Hey guys, today we are going to unbox an anime statue and specifically it's Dragon Ball since I think it's the only anime that I collect. I think it's been a while since our last Dragon Ball unboxing. Anyway, this is gonna be a short unboxing. So you can see the box is extremely small and this will be... I think a museum type statue. I pre-ordered this because it was particularly cheap I believe and I do want this version of Gohan and yes this is a Gohan statue. I believe this is a Super Saiyan 2 Gohan if I'm not mistaken. Oh we do have an art box so at the front we have the Gohan statue in black and white it's from Wolf Studios Okay, we have a colored photo here, same photo here, nothing at the back. And actually, we can see the full statue here. Okay, this will most likely come in a few pieces. We do have a free gloves and we have two USB Type-C for its light-up features. And it does come with this certification, I believe. Yeah, it's actually pretty good. It's a certification of authenticity. It's on Gohan, made for ardent fans. So the edition size is 399 and I got 82. So the signature of Wolf is just a W. We have Gohan. Oh, it also comes with this. I believe this is for makeup, but it's going to be used for cleaning. So this will be helpful for other stuff. But for now, we're gonna put it aside. Came in two layers. So let's look for the base first. Oh, we have the remote for the light up features. The base is here. It's actually really, really small. Ta da! We have one of the smallest base. And we're just going to remove the stuff that's here. Hmm. It's a removable thing. I think this is for the aura, so the base for that is a whole different base, which is odd. Okay, we have, it looks like a smoke. I think it goes here. It doesn't actually go, oh, okay. It goes here. What else is here? I think it's just Gohan and his, his head. We got another smoke thing. This time it's a little bit bigger. So we'll most likely go here. Let's pull out Gohan. Hopefully there are no small pieces that would break. So Gohan's left foot does have a key and peg which will go right here. So we have the base backwards. There you go. And then we have Gohan's head. Very nice pointy hair, small face. I'm not sure if it's the right scale. Hopefully that it is. Moving on, let's go to the first layer. Back to the first layer. We are going Okay, though, so the hour thing goes here. I think the other stuff that will be left in here are for auras. The most annoying thing is trying to find where the auras go. I think there are a lot. And I can find this. There are a lot of keyholes actually on Gohan's body for the auras. So you just need to find them. So I think we got one right. Okay, so we got one here in the leg. And we have one more for the other arm, I believe. I think we are not putting the auras properly. I think I'm just installing them randomly at this point. So there are a lot. I just can't see them properly. Okay, we got four. Still got like two more slots for auras. Okay, well, that is the last aura. So there are six on his body. And we have, I think, the last one here at the front. And let's put this here. This is for the last aura at the back. So I guess this is optional, which is odd. I would have preferred the base to be one piece. Yeah, that was supposed to be the right one. Yeah, I think this has the form. Yeah, okay, so this has the form and I do need to hit blower this, I think. 
yeah, it has greatly warped. It's now really straight, as you can see here. But anyway, as for this one without the LiDAR feature, we have completely assembled that. 